What's up guys? So it's uh, my last day in the barracks here at Great Lakes. Thought I'd give you guys a tour because you know I'm always on YouTube looking at barracks when I'm trying to pick you know, dream sheet selections. This applies to the student and staff. I'll get into that in a second. So if your staff come here, this applies to you. If your student come here, this applies to you. This barracks is still what you guys are gonna be staying in, whether that be your, uh, you know, RTC drill commander, you know, and you have kids at home, so you have to live in the barracks, or, uh, you know, your medical officer, or your TSC, you know, anything, anything staff, you're here, anything A school, you're here. Let's get into it. So when you first walk into the barracks right here, Turn in, you have your common space, Alpha and Bravo, because you're sharing this place. Complimentary vacuum, you come over here, they give you guys a mini fridge to share. Cabinets for storage, cabinets for storage, cabinets for storage, microwave. Uh, you have a sink. All that miscellaneous stuff you're seeing added obviously doesn't come with the room. Temperature gauge is over here. I'm hanging, hanging all my stuff on it just because I'm PCSing literally today. Thought I'd, you know, get this in for you guys. Vac vacuum comes, that doesn't come with it. Swing your way over here, you have a full size mirror, full body mirror, medicine cabinet, one sink, uh, storage underneath if you want, bathroom. Now let me explain something about this bathroom before you guys freak out, oh God, it's so small. Uh, normally there's a tub and normally it's way wider, it's like over here. The problem is I'm next to the elevator, like I'm literally at the edge of the building, at the edge of one of the curves on the building and the elevator's there so I get I get gypped, and then come in here. This is gonna be your room. Full size beds, a uh, decent amount of space underneath the beds. Give you a desk. This is what the room kind of looks like. Yours is gonna be a little wider. Like I said, I'm with the elevator. So you get a desk, desk is really nice. Pulls out, uh, three drawers, three drawers, two drawers. Complimentary fan, complimentary light. There's a fan overhead and the light on the wall. Let's give you guys a little 360. Man, it is hard to get a 360. I'm trying to get a wide angle. <laughs> this is better for you guys. So, um, like I said, I'm an edge right next to the elevator. There's hallways going into the other parts of the building. This building breaks off into like seven buildings and they're all connected through these walkways. They're like seven stories up. Here's the closet. It's actually really big. It's a walk-in closet. So you go in here, and you cut the corner. See, I've always wondered if I could just like turn off the power to the building here, or the elevator. Like I, I'm the only one that I know that has that, so I don't touch it just because they're gonna know who did it, but <laughs> I've always thought, I'm like, wow, maybe I could turn off the elevator while someone's in it. <laughs> So how this applies to staff and student, if you are staff, whether that be a drill instructor, a obviously this doesn't apply to people who are opting for BH and living off base if you're an E5 or above, but you know, so if you're a drill instructor, uh, NRTC instructor, is that a thing? No. So if you're a drill instructor, A school instructor, uh, you know, gun range, uh, corpsman working at the hospital, yeoman working for admin, etc. Staff is going to be here um, currently. It's 2017 right now, it's March. Uh, but I do know they have plans of moving all the A schoolers in here and they're going to move all the staff into the A school barracks. I don't know if they're renovating the A school barracks for the staff, but how I was told it's going to work is every single A school at Great Lakes, because there's tons and tons of people at Great Lakes, tons and tons of A schools, they're all going to share a board hall which is this building right here. And then all the staff are gonna get designated uh, A schools and E3s are gonna be in one building. Um, E4 to like E6 or something are gonna be in the next building. And then uh, E7 above plus officers will obviously have their own barracks over there. So that's the plan, depending on when you're watching this, when you are watching this is depending on what barracks you're gonna stay in. But if you're anywhere close to 2017 March and your staff, this is what you have to look forward to. If you're an A school student or you know, you're gonna join the Navy and your job location has your A school here, then you get this ginormous room for your first experience and you don't have a roommate. Well, you share a common space, but I mean, that's pretty unheard of for A schoolers. Like, <laughs> you know, there's some A schools where people are four beds to a room. So if you get here, you're pretty lucky, I guess. All right, anyway, if this helped you out, leave a like, it helps me out and I'll see you guys.